Hello and welcome to my next tutorial. In this tutorial, I want to show you how to convert a model from OBG to MDX and with Milkshape and optimize it with 3ds Max to um, save some file size. <coughs> First of all, you can find all tools, Milkshape, the uh, model itself. You can find them in my Discord group. The link is um, down below. And let's gonna start. First of all, we're gonna have to export it to the um, object. We could call it Gigan Perfect, yes. Export it. Done. Then we go to Milkshape and open up Milkshape. Then we have to go File, Open, then this, this Evelyn Shine model here, so you can see this here is something blue, that's the bone, and the model itself, we're gonna delete the model, as if you click on Delete, then you will see the bone is still there, then you go to Import, Wavefront Object, click on Cheek and Perfect, then we go to Joints here, Double click on root, as you can see the root is right now red. Then go to groups, double click on every group. And then we go to export. <coughs> Rockcraft free MDR, yes. Just take a while. Then call it Gigan Perfect, yes. Save and just for you to know, um, I can I show you where where you find the tools is here under software. Here you can find convert text, then Evelyn Shine, and Milkshape itself with the serial. So we can close it because we already converted it to MDL. If we try now to start, that will happen. Text tool not found. We need to add something before. I'm gonna close this one. We need to go to the. Sorry. So we need to go to the. Uh, yes. Yes. Okay. We need to go to the. Um, here to the convert text gonna copy that go to the cheek and perfect MDL then we need notepad edit with notepad then here past heading here we're gonna delete everything carefully until this point then gonna we copy the the text here before and now we're gonna paste it right here and save it and as you can see now we can open the model with MDL YS but it has no textures so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna save as <clears throat> MDX like that yes now I want to show you two ways file save as chicken perfect 2 so if you have 3ds max then you're gonna import the one of the models in 3ds max reset yes Import downloads Shinobi Striker Chigan, the perfect one, it's imported. Yes, so it worked. The model uh, this is gonna take a while, maybe I don't know. I need around 20 minutes until the model was inside. So, 
as you can see there is the export failed error that we don't care about that because it has no animation so let's take a look first of all we have to import a texture go here to the material editor then we go to Jigen and we're gonna import the texture and the eyes so we're gonna select that's the eyes here and that's the other things so okay now the next thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna select the body part here and we go to edit able mesh yes and go to element and we're gonna select the elements of the model and detach them that it's better for warcraft then here detach that yes so that's okay let's detach this part here the body So I think the hair should be detached as well. Detach yes. Okay. That should be alright now. Okay, that's easier for us to work with it and now we're gonna go to export the model again and just for you to know how, what um, changed now from the file size I'm gonna show you I'm gonna call it chicken 3ds max so it's done we don't need some warnings so let's take a look about the change of the file size we have the 3ds max version oh, it didn't change that much okay but in that case by the model it changed not much but by other models uh, sometimes it could save around 300 kilobyte or something like that 200 by 300 kilobyte this model is um, they work good at this model it's custom so and what we have to do next is convert the texture as well that's why I'm gonna open my program GIMP to add the texture and change it to TGA or BMP I'm gonna add this texture here Okay, I hope it's alright. So we're gonna export as the TGA, yes, and we're gonna export, uh, import the next one, the eyes. Gonna export it as TGA, yes. Gonna can close this program. I'm gonna use the Warcraft Reef viewer now. Go on TGA to BLP. Download Chicken. Uh, that one to BLP. Yes. That one as well. Okay. So, and if we take a look now at our model. It's completely converted and now I'm gonna show you the other method or technique to to convert the model we need for that the Marcos world editor we go to chicken 
so I can hear. We're gonna open the Gigant Perfect. Then we go to the Texture Manager. Gonna remove that texture here. Remove that one. Gonna import the BLP and the IBLP. Go to right click on the texture, then add it, then wrap white and high like that. Go to the eye, do the same. Then we go to Windows, Material Manager, and we're gonna delete that material here. Then we take here the texture. Then we go to Unshine Two Sided. We um, um, filter mode to none. Yes, as you can see, the model is has now every texture, but the eyes are missing. That's why we're gonna create a new material in the Material Manager. Create a new one. Click on the eyes. Unchain the two sided. Yes. Then we go to Geoset Manager here. I should make it bigger, maybe, that you can see better. Geoset Manager here. We have three geosets right now. Now let's take a look which one is the eye. By double click on the geo set here to material ID and change the material. That was the eyes. Perfect. Um, if it's not if it's um if it's not the eye, then you um need to um select the geo set again, make it back, and try the next one, and look if it's right or not. In that case. The first one was alright, but just for the future. So, and save it. And now what you have to do now is just to import the model again into 3ds Max and make more groups that you can better work with it. And I hope you liked the video. If you have any question, you can always write to me at my Discord group. And see you soon for the next tutorial. Bye!